Welcome back to Mommy Hates Cooking. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to smoke bologna on your smoker right outside. Let's get started with this easy recipe and method. First, let's go over the ingredients. There's just two with this recipe. You're going to need a three pound bologna that you can get at your local store along with your favorite barbecue sauce. We usually use about two cups of barbecue sauce. While you're getting this ready, go ahead and start warming up the smoker with hickory chips, apple wood chips, or charcoal. Now that you have the smoker heating up, go ahead and grab the bologna. You can put it on a pan or a foil lined pan, whatever you prefer. And then we're gonna score the bologna diagonally across the top with a knife. So you're basically kind of opening up the bologna up on top. Once you've done that, you're gonna go ahead and coat it with the barbecue sauce. Typically, I start with about half a cup to a cup of barbecue sauce. And then as you'll see, we add more as we go with this recipe as it's smoking, because you'll want some more sauce later on. Be sure to coat the full bologna. Now that you have the bologna ready, it's time to put it on the smoker. You're gonna place it on the smoker and then add more sauce if needed. This will cook for about three hours at 225 degrees, or you can cook it until your desired color of the bologna is reached. As you can see, now we're putting it on the smoker. Just put it right on there, and then you can add some more barbecue sauce if you think it's needed. For us, we usually add a little bit more, um, and then we use a brush just to brush it on there. Once it's fully cooked to your liking, just about three hours, it's time to slice it and serve it. Carefully slice the bologna and then serve with additional barbecue sauce and your favorite sides. I hope you enjoyed learning how easy it is to make smoked bologna right at home. You can find this recipe and more over on mommyhatescooking.com. As always, be sure to like this video and subscribe so that you don't miss any more recipes. I'll be sharing another one soon. Thanks so much for tuning in.